We are having a duel over here at Car Kill today. Whoa, top! Alright, so we've been saying it for weeks now that we want to move our goats around and get them bred. And we well, just, you know, time has been our enemy. But today we're going to try it and hopefully we get it them switched over without a bunch of chaos. Hopefully. <laughs> That's easier said than done, right? Uh, one issue might be that since we've been so busy with things around here that we may have missed the window of opportunity with the Nubians, but we're going to see. We're going to see. It's not going to hurt anything to move them around. I'm going to wait to feed Moo Man and the boys or any of the goats because we're going to use food to help move them. But we are going to feed this lovely gent right here, Mr. Nuggy. What's up, buddy? How are you and your buddies doing? Hmm? Here comes the alarm system. Come on, alarm system. Not yet, ladies. Not yet. Tuck, Tuck. Good morning, Tucker. Tucker said that she's not having any part of this this morning. Go on, get you a little bite. You spill more than you eat. You know that? Yeah, you spill more than you eat. Yes, you do. Right, here you go. Get you some more. You done? Well, hello, Roomba. Roomba, there's some on the ground for you to get. Me and Tucker are gonna go get the trailer. All right, you and Tucker go get the trailer. Let's go, Tucker. Look at her. Stuff all over. What is that? Mulch, I think. Mulch. <laughs> You're looking mighty bad this morning. Tuck, tuck. All right, we'll be right back. Okay. Now our plan is is to take the horse trailer and put it in each paddock and load up the goats that we want to switch paddocks with. So we're going to take the boys that are going to go into the girls' goat pen via horse trailer. That way it's not total chaos. Because I think if we were to just let them out, it's not going to go as planned. And the reason why we're doing it this way is we got really two breeds of goats on our farm. We have Nigerian Dwarfs, which are Bootsy, Bo Peep, Tipper, and Topper. And we have Nubians, which are Fifi, Capri, and Big Joe. Now, both these goats are dairy breeds. The Nigerian Dwarfs are known for their size and small stature because they are a small goat hence the name but they produce a good bit of milk for their size and their milk is beloved for their high butterfat content now the nubians they're known for for how much milk they can produce known for the great taste the milk has and usually is your one of your most common goat breeds when it comes to making cheeses and that kind of thing because they do produce a lot a lot of milk for a long period of time and they're also known for them big floppy ears they got in that roman nose both these goat breeds are pretty docile the nubians are typically extremely docile and if you bottle feed a nubian generally it's like a little puppy like a dog it'll follow you everywhere the nigerian dwarfs again we bottle fed ours but they are a little more independent versus the Nubians. Now the two Nubians we got, or actually all three of the Nubians we got, weren't bottle fed and you can still see how friendly they were or are. So if we were to feed Moody right now, he would eat and then we would go in there and try to load the boy goats up and have to contend with Moody, which is like having a 15, 1600 pound lap dog. What's up, ACDC? Roomba. Roomba won't stay in here, y'all. She gets out all the time. She just won't stay in here. She says the heck with it. 
There's Mr. Corny over there. That's ACDC talking to his ladies. Yeah. All right, let's go check on the other chickens. Mary Carl's already taking care of her little call ducks this morning. Mallow and... What's the other? Mochi. Mallow and Mochi. What's going on, Tommy? Big day today, Thomas. Yeah, we're gonna try to move the goats. I see you're excited about it. Thanks. We are too. What's up, Timmy? What's going on, buddy? Huh? What's up, Timmy and Melinda? Hey, Timmy. We're gonna try to move the goats today. You wanna help? Nugget. Whoa, you about fell over backwards. You don't got eyes in the back of your head, do you? <laughs> you about fell over your feeder back there. Are hey, we gonna swap the goats over today? Hey, so you gonna have, your neighbors are gonna be switch swapped. Yeah, you are gonna see some switching and some swatching going on. It's gonna be interesting. Gonna be interesting. I was kinda gonna hold up before I fed peaches. I figured the goats would I'm get it. I'm just gonna let it see it. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and, you know, she likes it marinated. Yeah. So I went and got her some warm water out, okay. of, out of the camper and I'm gonna let her food just get all mushy and gooey and the way she tells me she likes it. All right? So she told you how she likes her food? Yes. Oh, okay. We have a thing going on. Roomba. 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 I'm not eat, fixing this breakfast for you. Let's not eat the boss lady's food. She will fire you. You'll be looking for a new farm. That's right. Got her some warm water? Got her some warm water. And so by the time we get back down here and get ready to feed peaches, that's gonna be just right. What you got? Victorian crown feather. Look at that. That is beautiful. Isn't it beautiful? Look at that deep burgundy on the end. And it's like a bluish gray and a dark gray. So pretty. Yeah. Very, very pretty. How about you put it in your pocket? Yeah. Girls, are y'all ready? I think, the, oh, yeah. I think the girls are ready to eat and not be moved you more than anything. You think they are? Yeah. Okay, so. All right, what's the deal? Well, you've been kind of apprehensive about doing this because you thought it was going to be a challenge. I did thought it, I did think it was going to be a challenge, but you had the awesome idea of using a horse trailer. I did, but it may not go as well as I have it planned out in my head, but, yeah. you know, you got to give it a shot. Well, I think we'll feed Moody. Okay. And then we'll uh, lure the boys in the horse trailer with food. That's what uh -huh. I'm thinking. Okay. Leave them in the horse trailer. And then try to move. Come down here with food and get the girls, the Nubians. I think. Okay. And I also mentioned earlier we may have missed the window. We may have because it's usually August to January on yes. the Nubian seasonal heat. Mm -hmm. Um, Nigerians are a monthly cycle. Right. So we didn't miss the window there. Yeah, the Nigerians will be bred. Now, goats are bred for five months. So I'm thinking April, May, we'll have babies. Right. Um, and Mary Carl and I have talked about it, and we would like to keep a baby. Okay. Um, we don't know which breed it'll be, but our thinking was if we wanted to breed that baby and it's a female, that uh -huh. we could cross it with the opposite of the daddy. And create like a mini Nubian or a, you know, Nigerian. Um, yeah, that's right. Nubian and, mix. And that's how you get a mini Nubian, is uh. Okay, come here. Yeah. You get a mini Nubian by <laughs> crossing the uh, Nigerian dwarf with the uh, Nubian. That's right. We do want to milk them, but it may we not happen this spring because we'll, we'll be in the middle yeah. of building yeah, a yeah, house. We'll but that's okay. Right. They um. We want to go ahead and and breed them and have some babies from. These beautiful girls. Let's try to move them. All right, May Carl, we're going in. We'll see you later. <laughs> Let us know when you get finished moving them. <laughs> what was that? Uh. So I, I think I got it in a good position. Um, you gonna back it in there? No, I, I'm gonna leave it right there. I think. Oh, okay. So and put their put... food in there and lure them in there. Okay. You know Fingers what crossed as it goes. What's that? Feed Moody. Yeah, we're gonna have to feed Moody first, no doubt. And our trailer needs a little work, but. And we've we're, got... We're trying to save our funds to where we can have some repairs done. We're right. just going to, you know, use this to, to pull them back and forth. So we do know that it needs a little work. We so. do need it to do. And we got a welder who's, who is willing 
to uh, fix it for us and so we're happy about that yeah he said let's wait and see what battle prices do if we yeah. don't need it immediately which we don't yeah so uh that's what we're gonna do yep hopefully metal will go down and we can beef that booger up a that's little right bit. All, right all right so you go down and feed food i'll go feed moody There you go, buddy. There you go, buddy. Now, one of us is going to smell like a buck today. Well, guess what? <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> what you got? No, you didn't. Yes, I did. Ain't you smart? There <laughs> you go, Mary Carl. <laughs> All right, so what do you think? Do you think put any food in here or no food? Because we want Joe to stay. Yeah, we want Joe to stay. Well, we want Joe to stay and we want Tip and Top to go. I don't think no food in there. He eating? Uh-huh. Okay. Come on, Tom, You just don't want the wrong one. Come on, Tom! Stop! He down. No, he's not. He's coming back. Okay, Tom, bird! Oh, food. Shut me up! Shut me up! Mama's locked in there with the boys. Let me up and let me out. All right. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. All right. Do you have a little feeding? Yeah, get Joe some feeding. Here, Joe, you can go feed him. Yeah, get Joe some feed. I got a little something special for Joe. What you got, Joe? But I might have to come back and do that. Oh, we got Joe a collar. The ladies are going to love Joe. We got Joe, and I'll go ask about our collars, and they help us lead the goats around. They're breakaway. They are so specific for goats they are a breakaway collar so if they were to get hung on something it would break off and um i think i'm gonna go ahead and do it while maybe eating i got you what do you think yeah and i got my gloves on and you got your gloves on and he's wanting to talk to a nugget over there he is they he... talking about what in the world's going on because they don't know he's not even wanting to eat are they are they, are they taking my buddies away what no. is going on oh, yeah. what is going on off you don't look very pretty in this one look this one's seen it's better it day. has seen its better day all right there we go off with the old in with the new nugget said right he's gonna help you i'm gonna see what the size is you just slip it over say watch out behind you watch out behind you he's just gonna take your earrings off <laughs> can he see my ears yeah, yeah. Hey, Joe. you're gonna be beautiful in this new collar can you get it by yourself oh yeah you got it that's good that's oh, good. Oh, he look fancy? Look These at Joe. These girls are going to love it. Woo! Fancy Joe. All right. So far, it has worked very well. Um, here comes a true test right here. Here comes the true test right here. Okay. That's a good idea. I think me and Carl filmed yeah. and me and you walked both I think you're right. at the same time. Nope, we got different flavors. Okay. Or animal crackers. What do you think? Animal crackers. What? Animal cracker. You think the bucket? Animal cracker bucket. Yeah. Boots, he's coming out, Jason. Okay. You got boots? Uh-uh. I don't want boots. I mean, did you have her back? You can hand me the animal cracker too. I got I her. I need some. I got her. All right, y'all get to know each other real quick. I'm fixing a letter in. Get back, Joe. Can you get the jug and hand it to me? Keep walking. <laughs> Go in. Woo! 
All right. We got him in. Moody said, what's everybody running for? What's going on? All right. Oh my goodness, look at her. Look at her frolicking. You see oh. her tail up? You see Capri's tail up swishing? All right. Well, that's going on. What is that foolish Joe doing? Oh goodness. All right, we got more, All right. more work to do. We got more work to do. I did not feed Bootsy and um, okay. Bo because I felt like the girls wouldn't leave. I got you. Yeah, I think you're right. If we feed them, they'll stay in there and we can get the boys in there. So, Eat. Mary Carl, I'm going to take Peach's food off and hold it. If you'll go ahead and get some food, put it in the trough. Yeah. Peach said, what are you doing? She's coming. Here comes the peach. Okay. All right. Got that done. You think pull the trailer over here I or in here? I think pull it over here, uh -huh. but not in here. Okay. okay. <laughs> That's good. All right, so everybody's in. That was a little bit of a rigmarole. It went a lot easier than what I anticipated, though. Tipsy, just give me the food. You want to go down and see what the other girls are doing? I want to swap Foxy. cameras. Foxy's got a smile on her face. Foxy, what you smiling about coming over here high-stepping? Huh? What you coming over here high-stepping for, you and Sunshine? Huh? So, Tipper said he has claimed Bo Peep. Tip has claimed Bo Peep. He is always like her. But uh, Tip's fixed. Tip is fixed. But hormones are running wild over here at Cog Hill. Look at baby Tip. Tip like a little girl. <laughs> uh, <laughs> they make crazy noises. Peter says she makes crazy noises too when her food's empty. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. Now, uh, Tilt's being protective of Bootsy, but... You mean of Bo. Of Bo. But, um... For it to happen, for it to happen, it only takes... Two seconds. Two seconds. It is, it is very, very quick. And we think that Bo may be in heat right now. Yeah, I think Bo is in heat the way she's acting. So Bo may, may be the first one to have babies on the farm. On the new 40. Yeah. And Bo's had babies with us before. She has. She's calling them. Bo is calling them. Tucker? I wouldn't get in there, Tucker. Tucker said they were calling her. That's a lot going on in there, Tucker. Yeah. Oh, Roomba says she's going to clean out the horse trailer for us. Good. I hear you, Roomba. What's going on down there? Things are settling down at the other side. We'll go check it out. Moody, what's going on over here? A lot, ain't it? Hmm? We got a lot going on over here. Yeah. But they are settling down. You can see Joe's trying to do his thing um the girls are getting a little more comfortable with him it'll be a little bit and uh that things will settle down won't they moody yeah sure will yeah yeah you hear that call by capri over there that little and eh, you see her tails up she's um she may be in heat see that she may be in heat. Am <laughs> you fogging up her camera? Yeah. <laughs> We're still making crazy noises over here. Uh, Bo, Bo's definitely in heat. Yeah. 100%. Swishing her tail, making that noise. 
She is definitely in heat. That spitting, yeah, that spitting, noise. that spitting, sneezing, and spurting, spurting and sputtering. See that tail swishing? Yep. Peach just said she got finished up her last little bit here. He uh, well, I talked to him about it this morning. And uh, they said he really didn't, didn't want to get involved in these shenanigans, to be quite honest with you. Did you, buddy? No, he did not. You know, I had a lot of y'all say, go get Moody's brush and brush peaches with Moody's brush. You know what? We're going to do just that. Let's see how that goes. Then when we get through to that, we'll see if Moody wants to be brushed. I'll tell y'all something funny. And I passed by Moody's old, I mean, uh, Joe's old collar twice. And both times I thought I was a snake. <laughs> Moody, I know you don't care if the boss lady bars your brush yeah I know you don't mind all right let's go try it moo man's brush on peaches all right peachy we're gonna try something new let's see <laughs> what you think about moo man's brush <laughs> I don't think she likes it well that answers that don't it <laughs> she just rather be scratched. She didn't care for the brush. Nope. All right, girl. We will not brush you anymore. Well, we got our answer. Peaches does not like Moody's brush. I guess maybe it's just too hard. She didn't like it. She did not like it at all. Let's try Nugget. All right, Nugget. Let's see. <laughs> Nugget <laughs> said, all right, here, look at it first. See what you see? It's just a brush. It's just a brush. All right, let's see. <laughs> Nugget's not even going to let me get close to him with it. <laughs> Peaches did not like it at all. Peaches didn't like it? No. Let me see it. Nugget don't mind. Let's see. Look here, buddy. You He's a little that? apprehensive of it. You see that? He likes that jewel on the top. Yeah. No, really. no, I don't care for it. Let me tell you something funny. Okay. So I'm filling up the pools and I take a peek over at the goats. And Joe reminds me so much of a pointer. Yeah. Meaning a pointer dog. He takes a step and he stands there and he's like he's pointing. And then he... <laughs> <laughs> it's hilarious. I wish I could catch it on camera. They, um, they've calmed down a good bit over there. They have. Yeah. Let's go see if Moody likes his brush. Now there is one thing I do know. Moody likes his brush. And yes, we are going to get Moody a scratching post. But they have to be pretty darn secure because this big old thing here and knock it down easily or tear it up. So we found one we like. And it looks like it's kind of set in the ground. I saw some people use concrete. And, you know, we're gonna move Moody into that bigger pasture behind this area here. They give him a lot more room. They get him a shelter built. They put him a scratching post in. And we're gonna do that pretty soon. So that's why we haven't made a shelter or a scratching post and all that kind of good stuff that Moody is gonna get. Um, it's just, we wanna move him into that bigger pasture. We don't want to build something in a boy's goat pen and trying to build it all over again over there. It'd be kind of crazy. So what's the verdict? Oh, Moody loves it. Moody! Moody loves it. You're the winner! It. Yeah. He said, get my little doop de doo now. My little doop de doo looks like Mo on a Three Stooges. Yeah. 
He even likes his face to be brushed. He, does. he even likes to get under his chin. Moody. See him like that under his chin. Oh my gracious. He's just a big baby. He is a big baby. Foxy, you a big baby too. Sonny loves it. Oh goodness. <laughs> Foxy said, give me some too. <laughs> Look at Sonny. Yeah. Goodness, Foxy's excited. Oh, so goodness. excited. Yeah, it feels so good, don't it? Yeah. My gosh. Woo! <laughs> there she goes. Let's go. Go, girl. Oh, about to knock me down. You like it? <laughs> go, She's not girl. not a puppy anymore, but you act like it. She does act like a puppy. There we go. Run. Go. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh, my gracious. Oh, Foxy. All right, go. There she goes. Woo! She said Moody ain't got nothing on her. There she goes. <laughs> her circle's getting bigger. It is getting bigger. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, Foxy. Your turn. She said, well, Foxy's doing her spin. Foxy is doing her spin. Look at her. <laughs> Oh, me! she gets so excited. <laughs> we still on it. Go, girl. Here we go. <laughs> Foxy. She looked like something in agility. She did. Foxy, who's been training you? I, still... I bet Nana's been training her. <laughs> you think Nana's been training her? You. You always find me here When the world thinks that I've disappeared You know just where to look You know just where to look And you, you have a heart of gold And I look forward to growing old cause I'll be old with you oh I'll be old with you I do, I do, I do, I do I do, I do, I do And I'll plant a garden in the summertime